Compton. David speaking. Hi, uh, yes. Um, I have a few of your carts, and I just wanted to know if you wanted them back or not. Uh, yeah, we'll take them. I mean, uh, are you asking me to send somebody to pick it up, or? No, I was just wondering what you're willing to pay for them. Oh, no, no, we don't, we don't buy them back. It belongs to us. No one else is going to use those carts. They cost about 75 bucks, but no one is going to pay. I have someone go around and pick those carts up. Okay, well, they didn't pick up these in time, because I found these on the side of the street, so... I can give you like a dozen for like five bucks. Sir, we don't do that. I know, but I need to make some kind of a profit. I mean, I got like a hundred carts I gotta move. How can you collect hotter carts? I've just been collecting them for the last couple of years. Well, wait, look, here's the deal. Uh, if you tell somebody something like that, that you have this many carts, they're gonna start questioning you. I don't want to go back to jail or anything. I just want to get rid of them and, and make some kind of a profit off of them. I mean, because I got uh, probably, you know, at least a couple hundred of them just throughout the last couple of years. I know, I know exactly what, what happened around this area. Compton, mm -hmm. East L.A., South Central, in this area, we were losing a lot of shopping carts, but this has been going on for a couple of years. Yeah. I mean, the problem is it's, it's the, I don't have enough demand. I've got the supply. I just don't have the demand. I mean, like the bums. They like the carts, but they, they're, they're not willing to pay me much money for, for them. So I'm having trouble trying to, like, get rid of these things. Um, you know, do you have any, like, free food or leftover food from the store that you guys want to get rid of that I could just, we could trade? I, here's, here's the other thing. I have about 96 cameras between the store mm -hmm. and about a dozen in a parking lot. Well, I have other people... Do it for me. Do the dirty work for me. Okay, but but what about me? <laughs> do you have a disguise or something you can wear? We could just meet in the parking lot or something. No, because I have to turn turn these people in. Whoever's doing it, I have to call the cops. I mean, obviously they have our shopping cart, and they want to sell it to us. Oh, I wouldn't want to do a deal with you if you're going to turn me in. I don't want to go back to jail. Um. Well, how are you going to drop them off? Um, I mean, I have, I've got a truck that I, I, I stole from somebody. It's, it, I mean, it, it can pretty much fit probably like 50 carts in a truck. And you, what do you want for 200 shopping carts? Well, for 200, I could give you a deal because it's 200. I would be willing to give you. Look, I cannot give you money. I can't give oh, you okay. money. But what, what, what do you, what do you want in exchange? Uh, well, what do you have in the store? Like, could I get, like, a lifetime supply of, like, soda or something? I can't give out sodas, no. Well, what do you have to offer? Look, I, I am the store director here. I can't do that kind of stuff. I, I do everything with honesty and integrity. Oh, yeah, that's not going to work for me. Um, <laughs> you think there's any value in the metal if I melted down the metal or something? Oh, just melt it down? Yeah. No. No? No. I mean, you could go to jail for that. Well, yeah, I know, but it, only if we get caught. I mean, I don't, I don't want to go back to jail. I've done it before. It's not really So fun. then, then I mean, you know, uh, <laughs> you, you better not come to our store <laughs> with shopping carts. <laughs> I mean, this yeah. is not a joke. I was hoping to branch out, you know, once I got, once I was successful with your store, I was going to... It's going to be a big Because there's some small mom and pop stores that... I've been selling them for like okay. five bucks a piece. Okay. Well, when we catch those small mom and pop store, we're going to take them away from them. Where we will call the cops on them. If you do that, you're going to have to pay me back. How are we going to pay you back? Well, if you take the carts from them that I've sold to them, then you uh -huh. owe me money because they're going to want a refund. Okay. But it are, it, it's our carts. <laughs> yeah, but you left them out on the street, so therefore it's trash. And we didn't leave them on the street. Well, you didn't go there. Customers get them. take it to, no, customers, not from my store here. If I see my product somewhere, I'm going to take it back. I'll call the police. I'll try someone else. Okay. Thanks. Hey, we're going to tell us again. I'm going to help you. Yeah, I have a few of your grocery carts, and I was wondering uh, if you wanted them back or not. Uh, what, do you get, what do you have them at or what? Well, I, I, it's an undisclosed location, but. How many do you have? About a dozen or so. Oh, okay. Sure. I mean, uh, you can bring them by. Okay. Well, what are you willing to, to spend on them? 
Oh no, we don't spend nothing on them. We can't spend nothing on them. What about like three dollars a cart? Nothing. I mean, I got like probably like fifty of them. Tell them if you want. All right. Thanks, coming. This is Ron speaking, Malview. Um, yeah, I have a lot of your grocery carts, so I was wondering if you guys wanted them back. Yeah, of course. <laughs> what uh, What are you willing to pay for them? What do you mean willing to pay for them? How, like how much you want to spend per cart? You know, we don't do that. You can't sell it to us back. Well, there's a certain value to it. I mean, don't you guys want them back? What's your address? Um, I'll let you know if you want to make a deal. How many do you have? Um, I don't know. I'd say at least a dozen. About a dozen? Yeah. How much do you want? Um, if you buy a dozen, I could probably give them to you for like five bucks a cart. But if you want to buy like 50, I could probably give you like four bucks a cart. How many do you have then that belongs to us? Uh, I got probably about 50. About 50? Yeah. What about all 50 of them? Yeah, so four bucks a pop. Four bucks a piece if we buy all 50 of them? That's yeah. like almost 400 bucks, man. No, I know. Well, there's the labor. Yeah, but... Uh, I went through the labor of getting them. Hmm. That's 100 bucks, huh? Hmm. When do we get them? When do we get them? Or how do we do this? Uh, well, let me talk to your boss. Is this your boss? Well, let me see if he wants to talk to you, okay? okay. Hold on. Yeah, you want to talk to the boss? Uh, yeah, is this the boss? Yes, it is. Oh, hi. Yeah, so I, yeah. I've um, I got a bunch of grocery carts, and I want to... I need to move them. I need to get them uh -huh. off my hands. Uh huh. So I was wondering if you guys wanted to one of them back. Yeah, we'd like them back. We there there are carts, right? <laughs> oh yeah, but I, I I put all the effort into collecting them. And why would you collect them? Oh, just to just to for help the clean for, for, the, for the monetary purposes or what? Uh well, at first it was just to clean up, you know, the 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 city, trying to make it look nicer on the streets, and then right. And then I figured, oh, hey, you know, maybe I can make a couple bucks profit for, for collecting them. About, about how many cars do you have? Um, I don't know. I'm not really good at counting, but probably about mm -hmm. 50. Wow, brother. Yeah. Wow. A lot of people just, it's a shame. You know, people take them far from the store and they just leave them on the side. Oh, I know. I know. We get calls from people, you know, on occasion saying, hey, I got a cart in front of my house and give us their address and that type of stuff. And we do have the cart retrieval service program, right? Yeah, yeah, but I think I got I think I got the cards before they got to pick them up. Oh, okay. All right. All so. right. So what do you want to do? Talk to me. Oh, you know, what's it worth to you? I mean, I give a discount. Uh, so, yeah, what are you saying? Talk to me. You, you throw a number out there. How about five bucks a cart? Five bucks a cart? Wow. That's a great deal, but, you know, so it actually is our property already, so we're buying our own property back. Yeah, that's, but that's, you guys... That's the only dilemma, though. You guys got to, you know keep them from leaving the store but that's why we have the cart retrieval program too and like you said you got them before they got a chance to pick them up well i, I just mean, wanted yeah. to take care of them i didn't want someone to steal them okay um 50 carts five bucks a cart i don't have the authority to do that i can only probably give you about maybe 60 bucks out of the store funds here at store level like i said anything over that it has to go through corporate level the corporate office that's yeah the thing. all right you know maybe i'll just hang up and call corporate okay all right Thank you for calling customer service. This is Shana speaking. How may I help you? Hi, Shana. I talked to one of the stores in my neighborhood, and um, I have a bunch of the grocery carts that have been just sort of laying around, and I've just been kind of collecting them mm -hmm. um, throughout the years. And so, okay. you know, I called to see if they wanted them back, and um, they they weren't willing to kind of, you know, pay for anything. And mm -hmm. so they told me to call corporate. So, okay. You know. Okay, so you have a bunch of carts um that are from a store near you, I'm assuming. Yeah. Okay. And you contacted the store and they weren't willing to come get them? Well, no, they they were willing. I mean, they wanted me to return them, but they weren't willing to pay anything for them. 
Um, what I can do is definitely alert management to this so that we can get those from your property, and I'm sorry about that. Oh, no, no. I, I took them off the streets and put them, like, in, like, kind of a little warehouse area. Okay. Because so I, was, I, I didn't like the clutter on the streets, and so I just started right. kind of tucking them away in this little warehouse I have. There so, you go. Yeah, okay. So I just wanted to be able to return them and get some profit. Right. Well, I can definitely alert management to that, and then I can request that they follow up with you on this. If you don't mind, could I have the name of the city? It's Compton. Compton, okay. And could I have your name? Steve. 